Out comes the cleanup, and victims beware. Scammers often try to prey on storm victims like the ones hit hard by Friday's tornadoes. Tonight, we are alerting you to the most common tricks they use. NBC 15's Andrea Ramey is live now with tonight's reality check. Andrea? Yeah, it came in, Greg, almost as fast as this tornado ripped through this Westmobile neighborhood, causing extensive damage. Contractors stormed the area looking for work. So this area got pretty much all ripped off. RJ Reynolds' Springbrook Farms home was heavily damaged during Friday's tornado. He took cover with his two-year-old in a closet. It was like a mix between a, a jet engine and a train coming all at once. Now the sounds of hammering are heard throughout the subdivision. Four neighbors told us they've had at least 25 contractors come knock on their doors looking for work. I kind of call those folks ambulance chasers. Instead of handing out business cards, put gloves on and help us out before you try to make money off of it. That's what I always see. So how do you know you're hiring someone reputable? For starters, make sure they're licensed. Ask to see the builder's pocket size license card like this one. Verify the card is watermarked with the current year. Also new this year, roofers in Alabama doing more than $2,500 worth of work must now have a home builder's license. That's different than a city business license. All Weather Roofing Company also offers this advice. Make sure they're properly licensed, properly insured, and not just with liability insurance. They've got to have workers' comp on their people. Things homeowner Belinda Rogers will keep in mind as she hires a roofer to repair her home. With the roofer, um, that's what I'm going through right now is trying to make sure we're getting somebody that has a license and mm -hmm. <laughs> is reputable and whatnot. And if you want to make sure that the company you're working with is licensed, we've made that very easy for you. Just head to our website, mynbc15.com, and click on the Find It section. Reporting live in Westmobile tonight, Andrea Ramey, NBC 15 News.